Hey, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. Do you want to learn how to use Adobe Audition CC? In this video, I'll explain the new feature, Audition Learn. Okay, Audition Learn, it's brand new in Adobe Audition CC 2017. Uh, if it doesn't appear uh, around on your screen when you first boot up Adobe Audition or up in one of these uh, areas over here to the right, you might want to enable it by going into the Help menu and just sticking Audition Learn. That will then pop up this dialog box. So the idea of Audition Learn, it's a really neat new feature in Adobe Audition CC 2017. It not only tells you what to do, especially if you're a first timer to the software, uh, but it'll guide you through in real time and wait for you to do things and uh, and feed back to you in real time. Let me show you how it works. So you can follow along and uh, perform such stuff like uh, background noise reduction, mixing dialogue with music for videos, even recording your first podcast with guided walkthroughs. So here's one called Getting Started with Adobe Audition CC. And as you can see, animated videos appearing there to show you uh, the app in action and how it works. Um, and it tells you even that it's a professional digital audio workstation ideal for mixing sound for video recording podcasts, radio shows, and repairing audio recordings, all the things we know and love. So to get started, you click the Start button, uh, and then it'll explain through to you everything. So editing views, it will explain the difference between waveform and multi-track. So let's click Next, and there we go. Up over in the top left, uh, we get click the waveform button to edit an individual audio file. And this here is an individual audio file that you can edit. So click it, uh, and there it is, the waveform edit editor. Click next and then it's going to explain to you how to record. Okay, it even highlights the record button for me which is really nice. Okay, let me start a new file and try this out. Hello, I'm Mike and I'm testing Audition Learn to find out how it works. Stop and then play. Out. Hello, I'm Mike and I'm testing Audition Learn to find out how it works. Nice, that works very well, so I've done that. Next, oh right, now it pops up and tells me that I can edit, I can use the HUD, the HUD, to quickly adjust volume. So let, let me try that. Fantastic, guiding me through, yep, I'm happy with that. Uh, changing the volume, spectral frequency, how do I get there? I click the button in the toolbar, which is, oh yes, it's highlighted it to me nicely. Now I can get that display up and use the marquee selection uh, to then select parts of my audio and uh, delete perhaps frequencies from my audio. Go to next and I've got audio effects and it even opens up the effects menu for me and you can see a plethora of effects available in Adobe Audition CC 2017. Uh, so uh, it even tells me it comes with over 50 audio effects which is mind blowing. Uh, on to next. Favorites are just a click away. Uh, I've explained these in some of my previous YouTube videos. Absolutely fantastic for doing actions or multiple actions very quickly indeed. On to the next. History of edits. Ah, uh, yep, that's down here in the bottom left. If I make a mistake, uh, Command Z or Control Z is your best friend. Uh, click next. Aha, it's going to take me into the multi track view. Let's go there. Multi track, here I am. This is something I prepared earlier on. You can see two tracks mixed together, and it will show you how to place clips wherever you want on the timeline, move them around. Click next. Familiar editing tools, uh, like for instance, clicking the move, razor, slip, and selection tools to manipulate clips. Very nice indeed. Uh, mix like a pro. Uh, yes, that's where I click over to the mixer, and I have indeed got a mixing desk at my disposal. Other great tools, yes, so many more you can use. Uh, like, for instance, you have got frequency analysis, as it rightly explains here. Uh, you can even take a look at the phase analysis as well, uh, which is another tool that's being explained there in Audition Learn. Uh, and power in simplicity, yep, let's click over to it. That's the wonderful essential sound panel that will allow me to apply something immediately to a piece of audio and get results just by moving sliders and not needing to know anything about how to actually manipulate audio. Fantastic stuff. And then finally, this tutorial just rounds up by telling me to learn more with the Adobe Audition portal, which is an extensions audio portal. If I click next, it will most likely uh, take me there so uh, I can I can go ahead and use it. Uh, let's find the extensions now in the window extensions. Yes, Adobe Audition portal. There it is. I can go off and I can, I can do more, learn more, click to continue. I even get a nice stamp to say I've achieved my first thing in Adobe Audition using Audition Learn. So I hope we're going to see many more tutorials in this feature and start learning how to do great effects and great things inside Adobe Audition CC 2017.